We gotta go to that other store and grab those other pairs of shoes, and we gotta see if we can find new sandals. Me too. These are perfect. Those are perfect when you walk. Evie, those are perfect. They fit perfect, Mom. And I'm <laughs> Look at Indy. Hello, everybody. Okay, you are catching us out shopping. Look how cute these little girls look today. We are out shopping for shoes for Disney. You guys, we have just a couple more days until we leave for Disney World. And tomorrow's Valentine's Day, and then we've got Saturday, and then we leave Sunday morning. So we are out looking for last minute things that we need for the trip. I, can I just say how much I hate shoe shopping? I hate shoe shopping for myself, I always have. Let alone shoe shopping for the girls, getting something that they like, getting something that has the right sizes and fits them okay. I, I hate shoe shopping, I hate it. Okay, so Tyson found, oh my gosh, look at the Pumas. Hey! Oh, hey so cute. Tyson found some super cute, like Converse style, just plain white ones, which I really, really like, um, just because that goes with everything. That fits fine? I love these florally ones. It's not falling off. Oh, good, that's great. Okay, go try on the other shoe. Um, I like white because it goes with everything, but I hate white for kids because they get it so dirty. Those are perfect when you walk. Evie, those are perfect. Okay, go walk some more. I love that. I oh, like those ones. Yeah, Andy. Those are awesome. What? Oh, those ones fit mom, huh? Hey, mom, look at these ones. Yeah. So, other problem is I need a new pair of sandals for the girls for Florida and Bahamas. But in Utah, we're a little bit early for sandals. So, they don't really have many sandals out they have some sandals that are like clearanced but they're only gonna have like one size they're not gonna have it in all the sizes that we need so that's gonna be my challenge today is finding a pair of sandals that are actually gonna fit when it's February in Utah okay you guys so problem they have one size for Indy one size for Esme in the plain white shoes sorry one size for Indy or as me, one size for Scarlett or Evie. I don't these, know what I'm saying. One bigger size, one smaller size. Okay, you don't have to wear them. Scarlett didn't wear socks. We told her to go put socks on. She didn't put socks on. Oh, you got them on. So now I'm like, well shoot, now we don't have two more pairs. So we're trying to figure that out right now. Okay, so we are gonna go with these white shoes. They're super cute and I'm gonna see if they have them in another store and maybe we can go over to another store and get those. Shopping with little kids. <laughs> All of a sudden, Evie has to go potty. They don't have a potty in there, so we're coming over here to Old Navy, which I wanted to go to anyway. So, uh, quick potty break. We got both of those shoes. They had them at the other store, one of each size. So, that'll be perfect. That was easier puppy, than I thought it would be. Puppy, puppy doggy, okay, let's go to the bathroom, Ev. All right, as a dad, this is what you're gonna run into when you have all girls and you're going shopping with mom. We are out on an adventure today trying to find shoes for Disney, right? So we gotta stop in every single store along the way and we look at shoes for two seconds and then where does mom go? Mom, where did you go? Oh, oh, now she's clothes shopping. So now we've got all these Valentine's outfits because apparently they don't have any. Yeah, right. Um, so we've gone from shoe shopping to now clothing shopping. So this day just got extremely longer. Okay, you guys, I found super cute sandals at Old Navy, but the problem is, is they have two nines and one eleven. I need two nines, two elevens. We usually run into this problem, though. Hopefully they have one in the back. Hopefully. If they not, what do we do? We have to go somewhere else. Oh, Yes. Of course, you found gum. Yeah, we better get that, though. Dad's breath does not smell good right now. No, we got our shakes in the car, remember? We just got a shake in the car. We literally just got a slushy shake, and now they're trying to get more drinks. Let me see. Can I have those so I can buy them? That is cute, but we don't need that one today. Let's hang it back up right here where it goes, okay? Oh boy, shopping with a whole bunch of girls. 
All right, you guys, so the problem is exactly what happened. Uh, they don't ever have the four of the sizes that I need. So they just looked at other stores and there's not any that are super close that have that other size. So we're gonna have to pass on those shoes and our goal is to still find sandals. Okay, so we didn't find the sandals. So close, one shoe off. But we did find them super cute Valentine outfits they can wear tomorrow to school, so that'd be cool. <laughs> Come on, Ab, let's go. We gotta go. We gotta go to that other store and grab those other pairs of shoes, and we gotta see if we can find new sandals. Me too. All right, you guys, we decided to come into Target really quick and just see if they had any sandals. Look at these ones. Those are cute and sparkly, huh? But we're looking for sandals. These are cute. I'm just already yeah, I'm seeing to... that they don't have the sizes we oh, need. My <sighs> okay, Andy found these shoes. What are you thinking? I love them. You love them? We have three pairs, again. Again, we're gonna ask them if they have another nine in the back. Yes. What do you think? How do they fit? Perfect. Perfect? Yeah. Let me see. How's your toes? Um, They're right fine. there. Good. I'm fine. Do they feel comfortable? Yes. Okay. Are those the ones you want? Yes. Do you like that I color? Want to bring these up. They're cute. I want to bring this up. Um, Disney World. Okay. Go ask mom and see what she thinks. Mama, these fit perfect. They fit. They fit perfect, they fit perfect mom. <laughs> Look at Indy. Whoa. Did you see her face? Whoa. Yeah, because I turned away for two seconds because I've been keeping her from trying those on so she can uh -huh. those She is such a girly girl. She slipped them off the she second I turned always away. wants the sparkly, oh, glittery. Those so actually look really cute on you, sweetie. Do they feel good? Yeah. Yeah, I think we might have good sizes here. Okay, Indy is obsessed. She won't even try on the gold ones mom's got. She's got the blue. Ones, which one? So I think... <laughs> Are those the only ones you want? The blue sparklies? So, Indy is between a 9 and a 10 in these shoes, and I'm trying to decide which ones to get her. Indy, can you try the gold ones on just for a second, and then you can put the blue sparklies back on? I know, I know, but I just want you to try the gold ones on for just a second, okay? Thank you. No, those are a little size. Oh, what did you oh just find? My gosh. Oh my gosh, where have you two yahoos um, been? We just go right here. Oh no, you found toys. <laughs> Girls, this is not the section we want to be in, okay? I like this This, one. I know you do, but now we got to put everything back. All right, she just finished putting on her gold and now what is she doing? She's putting her blue shoes back on. <laughs> They're my Elsa shoes, that's why. My kids have the tiniest ankles. I know. But their feet are long, like my feet. Yeah, they they got skis. Skis for feet. Oh, what'd you find? What? Girl, what's in there? Let me see. Let me see. Ah! I saw you. All right, here's my helper again. Hi, Ev. Hi. Hi. <laughs> All right, you guys. That's close. Ugh. Hi. You don't want to see me that close up. Anyways, we found sandals there. So, Indy's a nine in Cat and Jack shoes, and Esme did okay in a 10. I thought she would be just fine in a 10. She's got a little bit of room to grow, but I don't think she's gonna be falling out of them or anything, so that's good. They'll last her through the summer. Indy was kind of like in between sizes, and I didn't want it like slipping off of her little tiny ankle, so we did get her a nine, Esme a 10, and Scarlett Evie two 11s. This is why I hate shoe shopping. All right, we've got to go to that other famous footwear store and grab those other pairs of tennis shoes or like Converse style shoes that we bought. Um, and then I think we got all the shoes that we need for Disney World. What do you think, Ev? Are you ready for Disney World? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Tyson gave in, bought any of those Elsa shoes. <laughs> I get up to the restroom, I'm like, what are you doing? She wanted those Elsa shoes so bad. Have you ever wanted something so bad? Life lesson, we don't get everything that we no, want. No, we don't get everything we want because they wanted gum and candies at the other store and I said no, but she wanted those Elsa shoes really bad. 
She's now in the back putting her Elsa shoes on She's right putting this them on. She's going to wear them everywhere. This is hilarious. Oh, my gosh. All right, you guys. I am running solo into this next door because we had to get more. And uh, Tyson and the kids are staying. Esme is throwing the biggest temper tantrum. Yeah, we're, we're, not, we're not getting out of the car right She now. lost her privilege. <laughs> Hold, please. Get what we need, Mama. She lost her privilege to come in, so that's fine. You guys are gonna stay with Tyson for a minute, though. I'm just gonna run. Okay, yeah, we're hanging in the car. Esme was having a little meltdown at the last place. Indy couldn't walk. She had to go on my shoulder. She said she was done walking, and she couldn't walk, and she just fell to the ground, so yeah. Sometimes that happens, right? As parents, you got these kids, and you're just like, okay, let's get through this. Let's get it done. Come on. But sometimes, when there's four of them, they're all going off. It's like, all right, mom, you run into the next door. We'll wait in the car. All right, you guys, I am back. I was gone longer than I should have been. Way longer than she should have been. Have guys, been. where have you been? <laughs> there's a new store in the outlet mall, and is this not the most perfect dress you've ever seen for a cruise? You guys. Can I take, um, mommy, can I take these? Um, this, uh, my, my <laughs> she wants to take her Elsa shoes. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I'm gonna have to promote this company. Hope and Henry just found it right now, five minutes ago. The clothes are like Janie and Jack quality, but not Janie and Jack pricey. It was amazing. Like, I was like, so in love. All right, really quick. Uh, remember when I said we were shoe shopping today? I did, I got We ended up shoes. doing like outfits shopping today. I, what? What is I going have on? shoes for me with the girls. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Second potty break. We had to pull over a restaurant because everyone all of a sudden had to go pee. So that's what we just did. Now we're getting loaded back up. Okay guys, so on the way driving home, um, Ashley realized she was late to a church event that she was in charge of. So we dropped her off at the church and she's there setting up and doing some things for a, a meeting that she has tonight, a little event that they're doing. Girls are finishing up dinner. We did quesadillas and now we're having some fruit, cocktail, their favorite. Um, Evie asked if I would buy some more of this. Is it your favorite? Is that the only kind that you like? Yeah, I love a lot of those. <laughs> okay. How was dinner tonight? Quesadilla and fruit, your favorite? Good. The other two already finished. They are out there watching a little show called Simon, I think. So we're just gonna veg out for a little bit, wait for Mama to come home, and then see what the game plan is for the rest of the night. I don't really know what's going on. I know she has to leave at about seven to go back to that event. So um, we'll probably just finish packing and getting ready for Disney. Little tied up loose ends, and that's probably it for tonight. Hello, everybody. Okay, it's been super crazy night. So I am in charge of like in our church, like our activities. And so we had an activity tonight. So I had to go and set all that up and then do the activity. And then I went to the store really quick and bought the girls some Valentines. <laughs> so it's late at night. They're asleep. We got them. I got them a balloon and then just a cute bear with a little Peppa Pig Valentine. That's Evie's. And then a little Pez, a little Valentine Pez. So. I think that they will think that that is pretty cool in the morning. They're not expecting that. Guys, I've talked about this before. I'm not the Pinterest mom. I don't have these cute little baskets and stuff, but it's okay. My kids are gonna think this is cool because they don't know any different. <laughs> so anyways, it was a good day. We are still just trying to get everything wrapped up and ready to go. It's gonna be a crazy next couple of days. Um, but tomorrow's Valentine's Day and it's gonna be so cute. We don't have any plans. We don't really go out on Valentine's Day. It's so crazy. <laughs> so um, we kind of just stay in. We're just gonna hang out with the girls tomorrow and not really do much. So thank you guys so much for tuning in today. It was a crazy day out running around shopping. We found the shoes we needed, found some extra clothes that I needed. <laughs> and anyways. Yeah, uh, needed. Need hey. Hey, I needed them like you need a fizz drink, okay? Hey, hey, <laughs> hey. It needs a drink, it needs a Coke. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, then we have Saturday, then we leave on Sunday morning for Disney World. So, we love you guys. See you tomorrow, bye.